Hello everybody and welcome to the 2022 Red Bull Rampage. I'm Brett Tippy and we're here at the top of the venue. We're looking over the top and it's absolutely crazy up here. Vertigo, exposure, these riders are nuts. We're looking down at Semlex line right here off the deck. Alex Volokov and Sorgia right here and then all the other riders are going every which way and making their way to the bottom. We're going to go check out some of their lines and hopefully get some riding too. Enjoy the show. Here's Brandon Semenuk, four-time winner of the Red Bull Rampage here on the side of the hill, digging away. You got here a couple days late because you won the North American Rally Championships and you're making up for the lost ground, working hard. How's it going, man? Yeah, it's going all right. We're, uh, we're making progress. We got one last big one to finish up and then, yeah, just some connectors. Tried to ride a bunch of stuff this morning. So, yeah, we had a good day so far. The wind was mellow and uh, boys are crushing it. So, yep, keep pushing on. Hopefully we'll get this done. That's awesome. I saw you working on a few things at the bottom there, hitting some jumps. But I have to mention right away is the start of your <laughs> run. It's absolutely insane looking over the top of that. Tell us about what that is going, what's going through your brain up there? Uh, yeah, I don't know about that one. It's, uh, it's obviously quite gnarly, but uh, it, looks, it looks pretty good. The boys did a, an amazing job on it. Uh, it's scary, no doubt. Uh, a lot of consequence at the bottom. Um, I wasn't here when they started it, so it was it was one of those things we kind of just like we pull the trigger and we don't do it, and it was just it was just too cool. I was like, we gotta try. Uh, and there's a couple other teams that wanted to go in there, and uh, while I was away, they backed out, and that was a bit unnerving, being like two of the oh. two of the gnarliest dudes backed away from this. So uh, what am I in for? But no, looking at it now, it, it it looks quite good. So I think I think it'll go. We gotta you know ride down the chute a bit and check it out. So. They did a good job on it, it looks yeah, like. Yeah, they it's crushed like... it, yeah. We just got to get the catch done and top of the landing done. And after that, it's like, at least I can ride down the chute and check it out and we'll know for sure then. Yeah. Here's Reed Boggs up on the top uh, ridge and we're looking down from the uh, the left rider's ridge. And uh, it looks pretty mad down here. Tell us, tell us about your line and where you're going, brother. It's spooky up here for sure. Um, definitely going out of my comfort zone. I'm teaming up with Tommy G. We're going in straight from the top, trying to compete with the big boys like, you know, Sorgi, Brandon, Carson. So, you know. You're one of the big boys now. You got third last year. Doesn't feel like it, but maybe, I, I don't know. Just trying to show my worth out here and prove to these guys that I got the abilities, you know. <laughs> but having fun with it, just want to push myself and uh, the line's shaping up, so, so stoked. Yeah, we have to finish the big landing tonight. Hopefully hit that up in the morning. And then, um, but tonight we're gonna test this middle section, make sure that all ties together. And then tomorrow we gotta finish the top, finish the bottom. So hopefully we got a T to B soon. I'm here with Tommy G, who got seventh place here last time at Rebel Rampage, and we're standing at the top of his line, almost at the top. And uh, things are coming together. How's it going, man? It's uh, going good, you know. You're chilling, building lines, and uh, hoping to ride them soon. Right. Yeah. Where are you coming in here to get into this? Well, right now I'm coming from nowhere because there's no no path to get in, but <laughs> soon we're gonna just build, you know, in that little gully. Yeah. Just break all the way, jump, turn here, and then we here we have uh, on off, uh, super cross section. I don't know how to call that, but kind of scary for me to be honest. It's a scary one. It's not it's not like it's big. It's just exposed, and once you come into it, there's no way back. You know? Right, and, you're yeah. in. You know, like drops, you like, okay, leave the brakes and see. But here you actually have to do something to get out of uh, that little section. So, yeah, but yeah, everyone has scary stuff, so. That's why it's Rampage. I'm here with my YT teammate, Ethan Nell, and he just got a brand new bike with a custom paint job, so he's looking sexy mm -hmm. and uh, probably got a sexy line out there. How yeah. is it out there, man? Dude, it's coming along. This week's been a, a mega build. We, we might have bit off a bit more than we thought to chew, but uh, it's coming together. Might be crunch time at the very end, but we're stoked to have a line at the bottom. It's all, all new features, and yeah, I'm stoked. I got to ride a little bit of it yesterday morning, and worked really well, so I'm stoked. Nice. Have you teed up with anybody along the way? Mm, well, I was supposed to be with Tom here, but he bailed, so it's just me. I share this little section with Tommy G, and then it's all me. And then I shared with everybody on the, the jump at the bottom. Nice. So pretty much all me. All right. You feeling good on the bike? Feeling, feeling healthy? Good. Yep. Feeling healthy. Feeling good to go. Just need a little, just a couple, maybe a nap or two before before I ride. <laughs> a little beauty sleep? <laughs> yeah, a little beauty sleep. <laughs> <laughs> but we're good. It should be good. A couple more days. Finals Friday. Ready to go. Nice. And a brand new bike? And a brand new cheetah bike. I'm stoked. It looks cool. Yeah, the paint's dope. It's, it's sweet. I'm yeah. stoked. 
All right, we'll kill it with the cheetah yep. bike, brother. Appreciate it. Right Later, on. Later, guys. Ow! Woo! If he wins, he won't be a cheetah. <laughs> <laughs> here with Jackson Goldstone taking a look across the valley from the Rampage site. What do you think, man? Yeah, super sick out here. Um, you know, people are just finished off their lines. Hope to see some riding today, but it's looking real good. You've won World Cups. You've uh, won Hardline. Are you ever going to do Rampage? I mean, definitely, definitely on the bucket list one day. Um, you know, whenever that day comes, I don't know when, but uh, yeah, I'd love it. Where would you pick a line right here on this venue? I'm not sure, actually. Probably something down this right side. It looks a little bit more mellow, but um, yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. I'd, have, I'd have to be in the event to really take it seriously. One day, though, eh? Hopefully. Yeah, back of your mind? Yeah. Yeah, yeah for sure. Yeah, I can't wait to see it. <laughs> Here with T-Mac on the second last day of practice before the finals and uh, give us a day cap or a night cap. Night cap. <laughs> How the day went? There were some guinea pigs going on down here. I didn't pay too much attention to it. Me and Brett were up here focused on our top drop that we were both pretty terrified of. It's just there's no margin for error. Super steep, super steep landing to super steep run out to tight catch berm with big cliffs on the other side. Right. Um, and uh, I asked him if he wanted to rock, paper, scissors. He thought about it, and then he said, no, I'm going to go. And I said, all right. <laughs> and he hit it good. I hit it good with a little bit of mistake. So I just got to adjust my exit out of that berm. And uh, Look like you're a little inside. Yeah, super inside. But if I could make the turn by hitting it that inside, that's a good sign. Right. So I'll make the adjustment, and then make sure I can carry speed for the jump after it. Awesome. So we'll do that tomorrow. Putting it all together. Hell yeah. Yeah. <laughs> T-Mac, making it happen. Q. I'm here with Andrew Lacondege, and it was the second last practice day. Yeah. And uh, you got a little bit of practice in, and uh, one more day of practice. How are you yeah, feeling exactly. about it? Yeah, I'm feeling good actually. It was like my first practice session today, first day riding, and yeah, got most of my line figured out. And uh, yeah, can't wait to get on the bike tomorrow and dial in a few more things. And then yeah, hopefully top the bottom on Friday. I saw a big one you did in the middle. You got that out of the way, no problem? Yeah, I got a few things in the middle that they were good. I still got to trick him, but I'll do that tomorrow. It was kind of busy up there. And yeah, hopefully tomorrow we can just get everything out of the way and get a good night's sleep. The sun has set on another day of practice here at the Red Bull Rampage. Not much riding going on today with the riders preferring to do more digging and getting their lines dialed. But there was some guinea pigs and some riding happening late in the day. One more day of practice before the big show on Friday. Hope you enjoy the show. We'll see you tomorrow.